Okay, we've jumped over to the emergency backup uh, iPhone. So the landing gear is on, and now the uh, batteries are going on. Actually, I need to get my hot glue, because if I don't put a little bit of hot glue there, the battery might slip around. And you're not actually hot gluing the, the no, battery. It's you're just to make it. So basically, you just have a plastic instead of a wood. Yes. So now we need a little some spacers here. Let's see what we have that works. Okay, and you're just gluing that spacer. You put you put those spacers in so that uh, it was off of the so uh, heads nice of the bolts. Even. Okay, let's go electronics. Okay, so now you have a nice flat to spot to glue your electronics. Is that right? Yep. Hooking up the ESCs. Okay, so you're putting the ESCs onto the motors. Of course, they all will turn the wrong way. more. I'm going to attach them to the side this time because the power distribution will run underneath uh, the electronics to give... Okay, so that just kind of moves them out of the way? Yeah, and the cable And all the ESCs have been attached. This is forward. Okay. This is three. One. Two and four. Okay. And we're looking that. We're just pulling that off of the uh, off the APM two diagram. That's ready, but I'm just going to have the smaller one right now. Okay, what so size are, are these? Ten, 10 by 3.8. Okay, and those are slow flies, right? Yeah, APC. Okay, Jingyu and APC. Balanced out of the box, it seems. Does it look like a quad now? 
It's looking like a quad. What are we doing? Let's see our time. 19 minutes left. Okay. You might win those one million dollars. <laughs> Yes, I believe that's what Trappy said, right? He was going to send us a million dollars if uh, if you did this in an hour. Okay, and then at the end we'll we'll uh, we'll go and look over all the parts and stuff that uh, that you had ready. Okay, so you've got the uh, APM too. Yeah, and it's outputs forward. It goes like this. Just use that to tie everything down. Okay. And you're putting some hot glue on the chish kebab sticks. this down. This one will just get attached. Uh, no. Second loop. Okay, and the chis kebab sticks just hold the APM in place on yeah. the... Uh... And it looks, it looks aligned. 
fine for today. And you're just taping the antenna wire so it'll stay out of the props. So now, if I'm not mistaken, four and uh, if I had written down where the polarity is. Polarity on the inside. Minus right? is on the outside, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's number four. This guy here is number one. Oh, we need the jump start. Two. Okay. Three. Now, what I'd like to do is usually put the nice little tomato lid over there, but I didn't ready that. Now, here comes the power distribution. Okay, and is there any special reason you're using the Dean's connectors? Just all my ESCs have Dean's. <laughs> Historical reasons. <laughs> okay, you're done. This can fly. How many minutes? Okay, 11 minutes. So that's 49? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, gonna I'm going to move this camera over here. Okay, now this is the jump start that we've been having the problems with the APM that if Although we don't... Uh, supposedly it might be solved in 2.6. Oh, no, very good. Okay, here jump start. Okay. So now we need to make sure... We need to test the prop rotation. It's armed. So this one turns. Okay. Right. Four is this good. One is wrong. Right. Two is wrong. Okay, so you're just reversing the uh, prop rotation by switching any two of the wires. Three is wrong. Three is wrong. One looks correct. And there it goes. Fortunately, we can do a GPS here in my backyard. First of all, we don't have the signal yet. Second, it's okay. Congratulations. So, but now, Troppy might say that this is a this is a sissy copter. Okay. Try to disprove that. Okay. What can we do? 
the international standard of measurement. Baby ah, wipes. baby wipes. So this is, according to my kitchen scale. Okay, why don't you back this up here so that... Uh, it's impossible to read. It's, it's a little bit over four pounds. Okay, so, and why don't you weigh it with, uh, with uh, the copter too? Yeah, let's see, that's it. Okay, I'm going to take your word. It will not go with, the scale doesn't go as high. Okay. Let's see, this copter weighs three and a quarter, I would say. Okay. With the battery. Mm -hmm. So, the way to mount this. Now, Andreas, most uh, most people use beer for this. Is there a reason you? Uh... Once you're married, you give up on that measurement. Probably <laughs> might disagree, but okay. We'll wait and see when he's married what he uses. Although I haven't seen Troppy do a. He has done speed records, not uh, lifting records. Well, that's a good point. Okay, Troppy, you've you've, you've got your uh, you've got your work cut out for you. And this is not even, this is probably not even the max you could lift, but I hope that it will do this. Not that hard, not strain to the absolute limit. Okay, let's see how this is going to go. Okay. Which way are you facing? Okay, good. the ground when the phone call happened it stopped recording <clears throat> okay one more Very good. And which battery was that with? The 3S like or the 4S? 4S, 4S okay. And the, not, and not, the ESCs are a bit toasty, but the motors are okay. Oh, okay. Anything else we have to prove? No, I think, uh, I think that's about it. And uh, six minutes to spare, even with the uh, weight test. Excellent. So congratulations. Thank you. I think uh, I think I think the black sheep will be enjoying some nice, delicious crow. Oh, and you had an offer for Trappy too, right? You were going to offer to send him a uh, a, a kit. Yes. A Once um, upon receive of the discovery frame, we shall uh, we shall copy it in Word and send you a sample. <laughs> very nice. Very nice. Okay. Well, congratulations. Thank you.